Hey, YouTube. I have not forgot about you. And um, I am coming to you late. Um, after my birthday, I had a little change in events for me. Um, this is video 34 um, of my weight loss journey. Um, it was Sunday. Um, Sunday, I, um, got up, thought I was going to sleep in a little late or whatever. Didn't happen. Um, I ate, um, a nice size piece of my birthday cake because I know I'm not going to eat any more of it. And it was good. It really was. And just to reiterate, this is my weight loss journey. I'm going to have some ups. I'm going to have some downs. But whatever it is, I'm coming to you with it. This is my accountability for myself to be um, accountable for what I put in my mouth, for what I do, for every pound that I lose, every pound that I gain. Might not be the right way. May not be the wrong way necessarily. But it's my journey. Um, with that being said, I ate that cake and I didn't eat anything else for the day. Not because I didn't want to. Well, it's because um, I had got a call that one of my clients wasn't feeling well. And um, I was told they need to come in and see what's going on. He really not doing good. So I get there and he, he had a rapid heart rate. It was like 156. So I knew then. Yeah, we're going to the ER. So we went and we were there until, well, we was at the emergency room from like probably 10 something to one o'clock in the morning. At one o'clock in the morning, he was transferred to another hospital because the one we went to was strictly just for emergencies. It's not for um admission so he was going to be admitted so we had to go to the main hospital where he was admitted and i didn't leave until like three o'clock in the morning and when i tell you <laughs> i hadn't had nothing to eat nothing to drink nothing so it was nothing to record nothing to um report other than what really happened um that day i did weigh myself and i was 303.8 um and that was um i think up two pounds and uh i slept um Pretty well that night before but um i didn't record how many hours i had slept and i did not take my blood pressure at all that day i don't even think i had my blood pressure medicine on sunday or saturday for that matter i don't think i took my medicine but um that was how that day went um Yeah, so I needed to come in and um, report that, keep up on it. Um, like I said, good or bad, I'm reporting it all. <sighs> See my grades. Ain't nothing I can do about it. 
you know, the, I like my hair up off of my head, cause, I mean, up on my head, because I don't, can't stand it on my neck or hanging on my shoulders or my back or hitting me across the face. Um... Um, and in my personal life, nothing's up, nothing's going on. Mm -mm. Talk to my friends, that's it. Nothing new, nothing, nothing major. Just same old, same old. And that's how I spent my Sunday. All day in the emergency room. Um, and I just did not want to leave him until I knew he was safe and comfortable, um, doing okay. Cause, um, my client has been two years without a seizure and that's very major to me. That's very important. And I wanted to make sure that he got any and everything he needed as far as his seizure medications and, uh, he didn't eat anything that day, which is understandable. It's, I mean, it's a lot of times when we get in the hospital and on IVs and stuff, we can't have nothing by mouth. So the feeding wasn't that important to me, even though I was concerned because he's a tube feeder. He, uh, you know, it's his only form of nourishment. And he didn't have nothing since that morning. But he was okay. So I'm proud to say, you know, he was doing a lot better when I left for his, uh, his breathing wise or whatever. Um, no. So, if y'all got any questions about anything that I'm doing, please feel free to leave me a comment. Um, come check on me every day, see what's going on. I know I'm late. Oh, I did want to say this, though. I didn't get the chance to, uh, what did I tell y'all? Maybe I did, that the people from, uh, where we went ahead, um, Dinner at the pizzeria, the authentic pizzeria had called and um, thanked me for having my birthday with them and um, bringing my family in and even wants me to call them back, which I haven't had a chance to call them back yet because I've been so busy with work that he wants to uh, invite us back out on them. So I thought that was very special. And I appreciate them very much, but I haven't had a chance to call them back and, you know, talk to them. But that was nice. I shared it with my family. Super cool. Yeah. Which we were the only black people in there. Had a table like uh, 18 people. And then this little small establishment. And uh, people were, you know, friendly and some were anyway. And uh, sociable and even uh, complimented how beautiful my cake looked. And I did share it with uh, one guy. His birthday was the same day as mine, so... That was cool. Well, this is all I have on day 34, uh, Sunday, uh, October 13th. And shout out to my best friend, one of them that passed away. Her birthday was October 13th. So love you, Keisha. Sisters for life. All right. Thank y'all for watching. Bye-bye.